welcome y'all back to the one and only, as far as I know, the Shady Show. I can't do the, but I can't do that. I'm gonna talk about the St. Paul shooting here. I'm not wearing this for no cloud or nothing. I was never there. I'm wearing this because I grabbed a pot and it tweaked something in my damn arm again past that once again I keep doing that like and subscribe comment please and please y'all viewing run the likes up man run the likes up y'all anyways y'all know what I'm talking about and I have to say this as always they actually can't miss this part on this channel platform whatever you want to call it we don't ever put salt or dirt on people's names but if we do we gonna speak about you and we always speak on the motherfucking facts that once was and now what is I mean that once was and now what is um yeah I fucking tweak the shit out of my arm yeah that shit man I I'm gonna say now um it was fucked up um I was recording during that I don't, I don't know if I re I'm sorry that my shit's doing that it's my computer no it's the light it's the light behind me it's doing that I'm sorry y'all but um strobe is like, like I'm having a party <laughs> no but um yeah it was messed up and oh my god I gotta make that thing stop doing it stop it there we go um it was messed up I heard I didn't even I didn't even have to read up I just know certain people and I'm glad I mean as far as I know I don't know the woman that was killed I don't know any of the people that was shot as far as I know and none of my friends none of their friends as far as I know um but uh Overall, it's fucked up, man. Like I said in my videos, man. Like, after getting shot, I bet you that shit's gonna change their life. Like, they're gonna be looking just like me. They're gonna be cautious everywhere that they go. Looking for the motherfucking exit signs being there. Like, yo, some shit pop off, man. Like, this shit's real out here. When that shit... Actually, uh, this week I went and got the papers to see if I can repurchase guns again. I can because I beat that case and if y'all look it up I didn't do nothing I called those assholes for hours but I didn't talk to oh I didn't talk about that so oh that's another story I'm gonna have to hit y'all with that um, but anyways yeah it was messed up I had to call home and let everyone know that yo I was at home recording I don't know if I captured any of the side reads because I live next to regions and that's where exactly they went to and I was like I don't even know if I did or didn't I don't know but I remember that night though cause it was just like cause I always hear them but that night it was just like what I was like something happened something fucking happened and sure enough but this is a crazy shit so I walked past there. Now it's now the tape is gone. There's still cop cars there, but I don't know how they're gonna reopen. But oh, they don't have metal detectors now. They gonna watch. They gonna have some different shit now. That's gonna be like a lot of places now. Like they gonna have metal detectors and dress codes and shit now. But anyways, I walked past there like. A few days after it like happened the reason why I didn't do that this, this video when that first happened I wanted to just wait you know what I'm saying so I walked past there and it was still taped off but they had the door open and I walked past it and and if y'all watch if, if y'all watch first 48 y'all already know that there's like cones like these these little you, cones that they put up and they were scattered all in there like you walk past it like I was on the the other side of the, sh the street because you 
because you couldn't walk right there. Obviously, it was a crime scene. So you walk past it, and, and they had the door open. I seen the shit, and then I seen the videos. Like, you, I mean, obviously, I already, you already didn't see them now. That's why I waited until now. And I was just like, man, all the people screaming in there. And like that, y'all don't understand. I've been in there. I know that place. It's not too, like, it's right down from where I stay at. And it's like, when the place is packed, I have to say, there's about 100 motherfuckers in there. Straight up. And, I mean, it's a pretty big place. It's a pretty big place. But still, at the max, in there, I say about... A hundred motherfuckers, like, 60 to, like, a hundred motherfuckers. And these fools wanted to do this over a woman. Over a female. Wow. People were shot. A life was lost over a piece of pussy women are you seeing that y'all are fucking superheroes are like y'all change shit watch who you talk to and on top of that if you don't wanna that's what I say in my video like this is just so stupid like I, this is what I heard I didn't even read up but what I heard is the truth, cause I know I know shit. The, I ain't gonna say where I got my sh shit from, but that, that that's reliable source. And it was basically over a piece of pussy, and it's stupid. It's stupid. This is ridiculous. Can't go nowhere. Can't go to a concert. Gets shut down because. Niggas climb on this, this stage or shoot out the side of it. Or go to the after party and start wilding out. Sad, man. I can't just fucking have fun doing nothing. That's why I got my paper now to see if I can get my gun again. And once again, I'm going to go about it the right way. Again, hopefully nothing happens. But everybody needs to have a gun and a license to conceal and carry. Real shit. This this is just getting out of control, man. You can't go nowhere. Like, shit, it's bad enough, motherfucker. You already, you might get robbed and shit. You know what I'm saying? That shit's even going up, too. Like, what the fuck? Like, motherfucker can't even just do, can't even just go outside. Shit. Random motherfucker shooting motherfucker. Like, damn, man, I, I see why people are suffering from these phobias. Motherfucker shit, I mean, reading shit up on the, on the damn news in, in the newspapers. Like, I see why everybody's still going crazy. But some don't care too, though. But, you know, it's just sad that we just can't go out and just have fun without being like this. Uh oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, gotta watch out for those. I don't even know. Or not even that. Just, it's just sad. It's just sad. But, yeah. I'm like, I just hurt my arm on the edge. Uh, this ain't for no cloud or nothing. I don't do shit for no cloud. Um, yeah, motherfucking arms hurt. I shouldn't have grabbed that pot. Real shit. I was gonna do this video without this, but now since this is on my arm, and my arm is feeling so much better. Real shit. I ain't, I ain't on no drugs or nothing. My arm feels so much better. But, um, once again, if y'all like what you're viewing, Run the lights up. Subscribe and share. It's your boy, Shady. I can't do the, but I can do this. And we out. How?